This is something I've sort of been meaning to touch on. Uh, it's a game. This is about a game series that I've been playing a lot. I've played a lot over the years, and that I've yet to buy the second game of. Nor have I bought any of the full games, outside of the original and the ACDC track pack. Yes, folks, I am talking about Rock Band. 2. I am talking about Rock Band. I almost said Rock Band 2 for a second there, but I am talking about Rock Band. And the whole party game series in general with Guitar Hero and Rock Band. I'm thinking that this series, both of them, the Guitar Hero and Rock Band series, they've lost their steam in terms of entertainment. Now I know what you're going to say. J-Rod, you've played these games to death. Obviously, they're going to lose their steam to you. It's not that obvious. Because I've loved these games for as long as I have. But what I'm talking about is... I mean, I still love these games. But what I'm talking about by losing steam is I'm talking, I'm talking about the party aspect of it. Back when these games first came out, you had people going towards stores... And just marveling at the people that are playing this game. Now you don't even see that anymore. Let me give you an example. First time I played Guitar Hero. I played Guitar Hero 1 back in like 2005 when this game came out. I see it in a Best Buy. There's a couple people gathered around it. They're playing the game. I don't remember what they were, you know, what, um... Uh... God, I don't remember what song they were playing, but... So then, I, I had never heard of the game, I, or I had heard of the game, but I never played it. So I busted out Take Me Out on Easy. Screwed up. <laughs> but I got hooked into this series, and everybody was around, you know, playing it. And I think this was back when I was at a Madden tourney. I don't, no, that was before that. So then I got hooked on the series. Now fast forward a couple years later to when Rock Band came out. Rock Band... When it first came out, first of all, before this game came out, I actually saw a trailer of it on YouTube where they were showing off, I think, nine songs on Expert. And among those was, uh, Here It Goes Again, and Wave of, Wave of Mutilation, I think it was, and Epic was also in there. There were a couple of them. There were a couple others, too. Uh, Learn to Fly and Black Hole Sun, I think, was on there. I don't remember. I first saw the game in stores, and there was these two guys that were playing on the game. One was on guitar, and the other one was on drums. I stepped in on vocals, and then people started gathering around. I think there were already two or three people around these guys when they were playing the game. I joined in on vocals. There must have been maybe five or six people that just stopped and, st and watched us play. And I, being a fan, being a veteran of SingStar before this game came out on vocal, on, you know, in terms of vocal games, naturally I played on a higher difficulty than easy. I played on medium. I think the drummer was on easy. I don't remember what the guitarist was on. We were just having a blast playing this game, and there were people gathered around, stopping, watching us play this game. So it wasn't just us three random dudes just standing there playing this game. There were other people watching us. And it was so fun to do that in front of people that stopped and watched us and had fun with us. So then I switched, you know, switched to vocals, or switched to guitar, rather. And the uh, and the guy that was on guitar switched to vocals. I didn't get a chance to play drums because the guy that was on drums said he couldn't play guitar, which was fine. You know, I didn't have a problem with that. If you can't play guitar, I'm not going to make you, I'm not going to force you to play. That's fine. I mean, I was having fun with the game to begin with, so it didn't matter. Of course, I was playing on Expert back in the day. That was when I was really starting to get good at Expert on guitar. And it was a lot of fun. So then another day rolls, you know, another day, a little bit later rolls around. Lo and behold, I go up there, and there's this guy playing on drums. So I decided to play on drums. He played on guitar. Then we switched instruments. I think I got on vocals at first, then... You know, played the guitar. Then this third guy came in as I was on vocals, and the other guy was on drums. He played on guitar on medium. We busted out in bloom. I was on hard at this point on vocals. He was on medium. The drummer, I think, was on hard. And everyone gathered around us. There was like, there were literally, I think, two or three girls actually standing there watching us. Literally, there were girls watching us. They were a little bit older, but still. 
And that was the party atmosphere of it. When you get people gathered around you as you play the game, that is so much fun. I've even had one or two instruments. One or two instruments. I've even had one or two incidents, incidences where, instance, that's the word I'm looking for, where I played Guitar Hero in an EB Games, which is, that was back when it was EB Games, it was Guitar Hero 1 back then, which is now GameStop, obviously. And there were people watching us then. We were, it was, I was playing on Versus Mode in the game, in the formerly EB Games. There were people watching us. I think I was playing on Hard at the time. It was like when I un figured out the Unlock All cheat and got all the songs. Because I'm cool like that. And then, you know, I've had a couple instances also where I've played Guitar Hero I pl against someone. I played Guitar Hero versus, or Guitar Hero Rocks the 80s at one point. I played Freebird Co-op with a couple people. I played Freebird versus once. It was fun. And there were people that did stand around and watch us. Now you don't even see that anymore. First of all, you don't even see people play this, you know, people play this game in stores anymore. They take them out because people damage the equipment, which is, you know, shit. That people have to fucking damage the equipment. But, I mean, sure, you still get the chances where people watch you play DJ Hero or whatever, and, you know, it's cool that way. I have had one or two instances where I played the demo of DJ Hero on hard, which I am decent at it. I'm just not that good because I don't want to spend time playing it. It's just a game I'd rather play in front of people. And it was so much fun, to, you know, it's so fun to play in front of people. Not just in your home online. I mean, sure, that's cool too. But playing with three people, you two, three people, you know, in a store you don't know, in front of people while people are walking around watching you, that's the fun part of playing Rock Band and Guitar Hero. I mean, sure, that's also the point of you have to really have this game, you know, with a group of people, but I can't do that. Really, I don't think Rock Band has the same snap anymore in terms of party games. Neither does Guitar Hero. I mean, sure, the party mode in Guitar Hero 5 is great if you have friends around you. But you can't play it online, which is, you know, bullshit. I don't know. I just don't see the Guitar Hero and Rock Band series having the same snap. The possess, you know, the where you have, you're in a store playing the game and the demonstration, and you have people gathered around you watching you. That's the fun part, as I have to set the headset back on my head, that's the fun part of playing Guitar Hero and Rock Band in public, is the joy of having multiple people, or even me as a bystander, watching someone. I love doing it. I love also playing where... I thought I saw something. Anyway where I'm playing on guitar and I got someone playing on drums and then on vocals and everyone's having fun and there's people coming around watching us going hmm what's this and they're getting into it I just don't feel the rock band and guitar here have that same snap anymore I mean when they start putting the stuff in the demonstration booths and people start watching yeah it'll regain the snap but I just don't think the Guitar Hero series has Snap anymore, and, you know, the Rock Band series has Snap anymore. In terms of fun with people, you know, at a party scene or whatever. I mean, sure, there's still there's still some instances where it does happen, but it doesn't happen as often anymore, man. I mean, it's, it's a bummer. I mean, it's a shame. I love the series. I just wish it would be the same that same thing where you play Guitar Hero in front of a group of people. And not just the tournaments. I mean, in a store with a couple of people you have no idea who they are, but they're playing with you and you're having fun and you're yelling out, Star Power! Or Overdrive! Or whatever. I just don't think... I, I really want to experience that again. Hopefully I will soon. But for right now, I just don't think the same the series has the same snap anymore. But that's it. Peace!